First, we want to enter safe mode. Type msconfig. From the boot tab, click on the box here. Now, click OK. Before we get started, we want to make sure that all the files and folders are visible. From the control panel, click Folder Options. View, and click the checkbox to make sure that we don't miss anything. Now, we want to make sure that there aren't any IPs added to the host file, which could transmit information back to the hackers. Follow this directory. We want to delete any suspicious IPs from here on down. Save the file and we're done. Now we want to check for any suspicious files in our startup folder and delete them afterwards. Type regedit. This part looks a bit tricky, so please take caution. Now there are a few locations you'll need to go through and delete anything that might be connected with the ransomware. Be extremely careful. You can damage your system if you make a big mistake. If you're having a hard time, click on our guide if you need additional help. On the right is a list of locations you can check by clicking Ctrl plus F and then typing them in. Just check out for anything that's been recently added. In the TMP directory, you'll want to delete everything. Once we're done looking in all the locations, we can restart the computer. We have written a detailed guide with all the steps if you'd like to print them out or if you have any questions you can write to us in the comment section in the article. Thanks for watching.